Good morning. We've made it to day five. Finding of the child Jesus in the temple. The reason why Mary found Jesus in the temple is because she kept looking. It was three long days, and those must have been very painful, not knowing where her son was. But Mary found him because she kept looking. In our lives, if we feel like we're lost, if we feel like we don't know where the Lord is, we feel like we need him, and we just we don't know where to turn, we don't know what to do, the first thing we need to do is to keep looking. That's what Mary did, and she found Jesus. Never stop looking. Also know, on the cross, Jesus gave Mary to us as our mother. So know that Mary is always looking for you, right? She loves you. She's always looking for you. In fact, she knows exactly where you're at, and she wants to help you to find Jesus. You're not alone in that. Ask her to help you in the journey to find Jesus. And the second thing that I'll say is that when Mary showed up and finds Jesus in the temple, Jesus just says, like, did you not know that I must be in my father's house? In other words, he's saying, like, if you're looking for me, this is where I'm going to be. I'm in my father's house. And the same exact thing rings true for us today. If you need more Lord, more of Jesus, more of the Lord in your life, he's going to be in his father's house. He's going to be in the church. So often I hear people say that they're hurting, that they're sad, that they feel lost, that they feel like they can't find God. They don't know where God is in their life. If you haven't been to church for a long time, I know I say this every once in a while, and you know what? I'm going to keep saying it every once in a while. If you're watching these because they inspire you, awesome, that makes me so happy. But if in the midst of that, you're getting inspired to some degree, but you're not bringing yourself before the Lord, you're not coming to the Father's house where he is, you're going to be missing something. If you feel like you're missing something in your life and you're not going to church, and this is not a condemnation, this is like a welcoming. What happened with the prodigal son? Right? He was gone. He squandered all the money. He's like, gosh, you know what? I guess it would be better off just to be a slave, a servant in my father's house. So I guess I'll go back. He made the decision to come back. He was still looking for something. Made the decision to go back. And what happened? Before he even arrived, his father came running out to embrace him, to wrap his arms around him and said, put a ring on his finger, robe over his shoulders, sandals on his feet, slaughter the fat and cat. Like he gave him a royal welcome saying, you belong. You, no matter who you are, you belong. Know that Our Lady is with you, helping you to find Jesus. Ask her intercession for it. And please know that Jesus must be in his Father's house. Come to his Father's house, right? Come to church. Be a part of the family of the church, because that is where the lost get found. God bless you.